Everyone looks to the past as the golden times. A place to return to in their dreams. But while the rest of the world looks to the corporations for guidance, the real warriors fight for the soul of the planet. Pilots who believe the way to redemption is forward, down a path of pain and sacrifice. A well-oiled axe and a steady hand will change the tide. Here comes the big guns, baby. Hello there, gamers. I'm Lazarus, and welcome to this video of a look at Hawken, uh, a free to play game that's available to download from PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and PC. So let's have a look at it, shall we? So this is the main screen on Hawken, uh, where every time that you start the game you'll start off from. Um, I'll qu quickly run through it. All these on the, what I'm highlighting now are all different offers, uh, upgrades, etc. that you can either uh, purchase uh, through in-game credits that you build up through XP as you win and uh, progress through the game. Or you can go to your store, depending on which one that is, PlayStation or Xbox or even Steam. Uh, go onto your store and you can buy uh, coins that you can then spend in the game uh, to buy um, new upgrades or new mechs depending on what you want to do. Uh, there's so much to that but uh, I'll just quickly run you through these. Um, leaderboard is basically as it speaks, leaderboard top killers uh, of uh, the Hawking world. Daily rewards, uh, quite simple, every time that you play um, uh, a Hawken game every day you win you win an award for it um, daily awards um, as you see on the screen uh, there's four um, that you can earn today each totaling a 250 each in-game credits and um, lots of thousand credits obviously can go to building up your mech if you do all those four wins um, talking of mechs um, I'll come back to that moment in a moment but um, this is the mech that you start with the CRT recruit it's a, a kind of basic mech I suppose if you like obviously it's a, a starting mech um, you can upgrade it though in various different ways depending on your choice and preferences uh, weapons um, you can obviously upgrade as you can see down the bottom there um, again in the red is the uh, game credits that you can buy or the in-game credits that you can save up to buy uh, is 4,130. So a bit of grinding is involved if you want to actually upgrade your mechs uh, over time. But the more wins that you get, the more points that you get, obviously the more money you're going to make and therefore you can upgrade quicker. Um, if we go down to internals, these are, these are standard on all the mechs by the way. I'm just showing you this one because it's the first one you'll get. Um, basically there's, there's so much content to go through and I'm not going to read it all out but there's many different uh, variations on things that you can uh, add to your mech to upgrade it to make it stronger, uh, recharge quicker, uh, better deflectors, uh, obviously to take uh, blasts from other people's uh, mechs, uh, basic repair kit as you see there. So they're all the kind of add-ons that you can get, again all these come at a cost, you can either buy them as highlighted there at 320 in game credits, or you can um, do 36 bought credits from your store. Um, personally, I've been grinding all the time, I've not purchased anything from the store because um, I basically don't have a lot of money. Um, but uh, I've been grinding quite a bit and uh, managed to save up a, a bit and uh, buy a few bits. Uh, items again. Uh, different uh, missiles, uh, shields, uh, bombs, etc. that you can buy. Uh, quick run through them for you. Um, again, all come at a cost. And of course, you can cosmetics uh, do cosmetics on you on your Mac if you want. Again, at a cost. 
Uh, just to give you an example, the other bodies here, you've got a normal mech there, but if you want to upgrade it to that kind of uh, tentacle octopus pattern there, uh, that's going to cost you 360 uh, bought credits that you'd have to go into the store and buy. Uh, or there's that there, or that there. So you can see, you can verify, uh, vary, vary your um, appearances of your mechs to pretty much any way you want but be warned it does come at a cost if you want to do that uh, taunts uh, different mech emotes again these come at a cost uh, as you can see they do different celebratory dances uh, every time that you win if you select it this one obviously is free uh, and the one that I have on all mine um, you can also go to uh, hollow emitters Again, you can either drop these during the game um, as like taunts at people or at the end of a match if you've won whatever you want to do really. But as you see, there's many different ones that you can just drop in front of you. I personally like that one. Um, you know, and, they, and they do various things like dancing robots. And so it's up to you really what you, you choose on that. Um, I've actually changed the one that I had now, but hell, it doesn't matter. Um, HUD, again, different various but you can change the different colours of uh, how you rep your teammates and your, your foes are represented and cockpit um, basically different decorations but again as you see they come at a cost um, that are not purchasable via the game and only through the store um, there's many different variations of um, uh, mech as well as you see that CRT recruits the one that you start with at the bottom there that you can see um, over the course, I've been playing the game now for five days, and in the course of those five days, I've, I've progressed quite well. I'm ranked 15 now, um, and I've bought myself a couple of mechs uh, through just from grinding uh, the, the missions and saving up my money and, and going out and buying and upgrading them a little bit. Um, it's not taken me too long to do it, and it's quite straightforward in to do, be able to do it. Um, one that I will show you now is this Neef. Sorry, uh, this is completely free of charge. Uh, I can't speak for Xbox and Steam, but I know that it's uh, available on PlayStation Store right now. If you just go to the add-on section on the Hawking uh, on PlayStation so Store, you'll see it. Uh, and just download it. It's completely free of charge. Uh, comes with uh, two Seeker Rockets on the front, so you can blow the crap out of your, your enemies as much as you want. Uh, it's not a bad little mech, not a bad little starter. And again, just like the others, fully upgradable and customizable in any which way you want to do it uh, in any which way you want to uh, to do that uh, that's completely free though um, but personally I'm rocking this one at the moment the assault, I quite like the assault uh, got double machine gun cannon and Vulcan XT cannon what uh, is uh, quite handy so they're the different mechs as you see you can as you uh, progress through the game you unlock uh, pathways as you can see they start off grey and then as you progress the pathway goes to green to lead you up to the next mech that you can buy so from the CRT I could have gone to Berserker uh, I didn't I went for Assault um, but you know what you choose and where you go it's totally your choice um, that's what the game's about it's all about choice and uh, what you want to do um, but personally I went the Assault direction um, Marketplace um, basically go straight to store and that's where all your bits and pieces are you can pick up your, your packs from there etc from there you've got settings of there but that's all for your sound etc um, and then from there um, I'll just quickly show you a couple of rounds of what it's like to play a game um, when you first start off um, you won't be able to choose any of these uh, team deathmatch missile assault you won't be able to choose any of these at all uh, the only one you'll actually be able to will, will be highlighted is, is uh, any mode and co-op team deathmatch. They're the only ones that you'll be able to start off with. Um, very useful though if you're not used to your mech and how to use it, then basically you're up against um, same level players as yourself. So if you're a newcomer, then you'll go up against other newcomers. Um, and if there's no newcomers, then you'll go up against AI, AI uh, mechs instead. Um, very good uh, for getting the basic controls and also just for end ending up rolling your daily bonus roller uh, as I do nowadays. 
Okay, so like I said, you'll start off on uh, co-op team deathmatch. Um, so to give you an idea of what you can expect from Hawken and, and what the play looks like, um, here's a couple of clips that um, I recorded earlier.
So there you go guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have, then please leave a like, or let us know what you think by leaving us a comment. Thank you very much for watching this video. Until the next one, 1010, till we do it again. When the night is over